Well, I'd say that if you were to look in a medical textbook um, or, you know, go to medical school, this would be one of the most fundamental things that you're taught. And in fact, when I set out to write the book, there was actually a, a, a lot of talk in the medical community about how for better care, medical care for women, there needs to be a better understanding of what makes women different. And I'll give a concrete example, which is that for the longest time, pharmaceutical trials were not done with men and women. It was just sort of, ran, you know, whoever they can get in a room, um, they would look at other factors, but not the sex difference. And then they started having a problem where they would put a drug out on the market that hadn't been adequately tested on women, and women would have all these side effects. And they finally realized, you know, for good medical care for women, we have to make sure that pharmaceutical trials include the right, you know, are done appropriately on women because their bodies are different. Um, so the thing that I find scary is the way that just really, even in the last year, you're seeing even the medical community sort of abandon that. And I don't know where that goes because I've been told by doctors in closed doors that they feel like they can't do their jobs. And do we want to live in a world where even the field of medicine, you know, starts slipping away from fundamental biological truth and reality? Well, I know the, um, the head of Phillips Exeter Academy's, uh, this won't be on the video, um, biology department, and he's been told he has to make uh, biology woke relevant. Okay, you know, same thing. You've got to twist science to say some predetermined justice thing. You well, know? it's like George Orwell, two plus two equals five. I mean, that's what they're trying to do with science. And you can never make two plus two equal five. Um, but do you want to live in the world where you're forced to salute to that, to the expression that two plus two equals five? Yeah.